hope you have happier news. What of Lord Delessa's murderers? The King of Beggars is dead. He was carrying this. Oh, Suppose are we back? You should keep it. It'll do no one any good mouldering in a forgotten crib. Can you guys hear me? Oh, okay. Whew. Wait there Thank for a second. You. I will. So anyone who's froze for them, uh, have a have we refreshed there and it should be okay. Sorry about that. Don't know what happened. Someone sent them after Monsieur de la Templars do nothing simply, do they? Do you have anything solid on this mysterious chess player? I'll let you guys watch this and I'll be back shortly. Uh, yeah, it shouldn't be long. A pin fashioned by a silversmith named Germain. But how he's involved, I can't yet say. It seems your course is clear. Find the silversmith, learn what part he plays.
<laughs> I'm back now. Don't worry. Hello, my friend. Oh, did we get ammo? We did get ammo. I think we're okay. All right. <coughs> And yeah, we did get another follower, uh, Slim. Thank you very much for following me. I appreciate it. It means a lot, dude. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm going to do some uh, fixes to the... Uh, to how my channel looks and stuff. Oh. <laughs> I'm not gonna copy here, sorry. Uh, no, I'm just uh, I was trying to wait on a friend of mine who uh, does actually actually a very good graphical designer. He's making me some banners and some headings and stuff to make uh, to bring this bring it alive a little bit. And I wanted to you know I wanted to look good. Everyone wants it to look good. So. Again. Just the air. <laughs> so yeah, once I get it all designed up, looking good, right? A few things make it look all sweet and stuff. Okay, where do we have to go? We're going here to find the silversmith, Thomas Jamon. Francois Thomas Jamon. You having uh, technical difficulties, mate? Oh, what's up with the stream? You just uh, can't do it at the minute. Oh yes, I just remembered. Sequence five. Uh, we've got some more customization to do. So I'll have a look at some of our skills. Uh, not going to bother with melee. Range? No, not really. Health? Nope. Go complete sequence five. Okay, okay. We have to com actually complete it to get some of the new stuff. Um, that's no worries. That's cool. Just cool. Yeah, so I'm gonna get environmental blending. Oh, I need to get a new capture card, okay. That's cool. Try to try to give your viewers something to watch. <laughs> uh, try to stream a bit more often. I've been sort of streaming one day and then taking a break and then streaming again, you know. I just uh I'll get into it. I'll get into it soon. All right. See you later, dude. Thanks for thanks for stopping by, and uh, catch you next time. Hope you enjoyed. We're gonna make our way over in this silversmith. We created the little dagger things to. The Templars used its Templar mark and engraved into the hilt of it, and that's what was used to kill Monsieur Azar. Give you guys a quick update on our progress 100%, 100%, 100%, 100% for the first four sequences. Sequence five just beginning, co op missions are later on. Paris stories are, you know, the Nostradamus, uh, Nostradamus Enigmas, uh, Cafe Theatre. That's all gonna be coming as we go. We're gonna take, well, I'm gonna take breaks and sort of do some of that stuff as I go along. And obviously, you know, we got the chests, artifacts, cockades, sink points, viewpoints, and renovations all to come. Fourteen percent. 
so far from uh, today, which yeah, isn't too bad. A lot of missions being done. Four sequences already, which is pretty good. And all 100% sync with only one reset. Guys, if you want to check resets or deaths, uh, exclamation mark resets or exclamation mark deaths, and uh, that will all um, that will all come up for you. I'll be updating them as I go. I've, I only have four commands, and two of them are for Creed games. Two of them are for Dark Souls at the minute. Because obviously, uh, well, Death was originally Souls, but I need them for this as well. Partly because I tend to die a lot in this game, which is crazy. It's quite difficult until you get your items. This is one of the, another one of the uh, Nostradamus. Enigma's not gonna worry about them just yet though. Don't worry about that. It'll, just, it'll take a while for me to bother with all them ones. Because they take quite a while to do. And another viewpoint. Let's have a look at what's around us. Another person lacks us, another fast travel point. <coughs> so, a bit of a zoom in. In this area. I think after sequence 5 we'll grab a few things uh, and then might do a runabout, try to get some of the items in the area we've unlocked here. So, they're just so we it with. Um, Grabbing items because you know chests and stuff are pretty, pretty big thing. That might get a little boring for you guys, so feel free to pop in and out whenever you want. No, I'm not gonna hold you to anything, <laughs> but I might grab a few chests after sequence five just so I'm on top of it. I don't want to be falling too far behind on grabbing chests and getting items and stuff like that. Because the more you do that, the more you have. To the game. Uh, that can get really annoying. These guys can leave that guy alone. And so it's nice. Thank you. Messy. To find that from playing uh, Assassin's you actually learn of uh, the language that is used, like French, someone who you know doesn't speak French and has never ever spoken, they can pick up things, which is handy. Now, you guys know that if you, any time that I start streaming, uh, hit me up with a follow, so that you guys know when I go live. I know where I will spend a bit of time when I get the resources that I need fixing up how the how my stream works on my profile, just making it look good. Well, that I want it to look good. Is it? <laughs> Guess this is not actually an assassination mission. Uh you don't see anything up on the right hand side. But we have to lock pick four doors and make two of the Brits go berserk. So we can get the uh, berserk Brits done right here, uh, right now. Uh, so we're gonna LB. Uh, oh, we need to get a little closer to these guys. So we're gonna, we're gonna free run down a little bit here. This should be low enough. Okay, let's see now. Can we hit both of them? We can indeed. Oh wow, what a miss. Nice, nice, nice shot. And there we go. That's the two Brits driven driven berserk. 
So they will now start attacking the other guys. And they're actually quite high level, two level threes. So they might be able to take out most of the guys in there, but we're just gonna sit back and watch and enjoy the fun. <laughs> one berserk kill already. There's another one. Now all you will have to worry about is lockpicking doors. The Brits are just gonna take guys out here and make it a lot easier for us to get inside. There's an alarm bell over there that I kind of want to deactivate. Fit right over there for anyone who's wondering. That's it right there. A little alarm bell. Yeah, it's always fun watching guys just like kill each other. I think the stream might have froze again, so if it has, guys, be sure to re just refresh. If you refresh, it might it should just come back online. Nice and quick. I have been streaming for quite a while, so I uh, might want to expect a couple of couple of breakups. It's probably gonna happen. I'm sorry, there's not much I can do about it. I haven't got very good <laughs> very good software. I am of course streaming this straight from my Xbox. So what Xbox can't handle Yeah the stream won't be able to handle so But yeah now we can start slowly making our way in here. Couple of guys looking for me, so I'll take them out. So we don't have to worry about them. And vision. A couple of guys there. I think I'll just double assassinate these two. Or at least one of them, that'll do nicely. Oh. Kill this guy. Or he kills me. And this one. There we go. And deactivate this alarm. There. I don't think there's anyone else really. There's a guy in here. Two guys. I don't think they come through this door. Oh, there's only one in here. That's okay. But uh, some doors are lock picks. I think get rid of this guy. Um. So we'll unlock this door. If we can get it right. Oh no. All right, I gotta <laughs> castle down. Okay, let's take this right. There we go. Perfect. Is that door unlocked. Actually, a guy at the end of that, so I don't even want to go that way. But we're gonna look around for doors. Another one over here, which is unlockable. So we'll just do that real quick. Boom! 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 Bingo. That's. Oh, okay, that was a miss, apparently. Okay, I thought I got it there. Oh no, she's horrible. Watching, <laughs> watching that back, I was like, oh god. <laughs> Nowhere near, was I? Are these two boys. Less to worry about. And this guy too, he can die. Another couple of doors. We got one door downstairs and that door over there. So we obviously want to uh, open all the doors for the full synchronization. Some of the full syncs are a bit stupid, but oh, I keep on missing. I can't miss anymore. I'm running low on my lockpicks. But this actually leads us over to an artifact, and this door is another lockpick door. So I think we'll just open this one. So that we have all the lockpick doors done. So that will mean I'd less to do. Alrighty. Now we just have to kill. Which is obviously the uh, the easier part. Because generally in Assassin's Creed games you can run in and just kill kill your target and walk away. But let's be honest, that's no fun, is it? That's no fun. We want to take them all down. Germain, the silversmith. Thank God. Been holding me for months. Please get me out of here. First, I need to know about this. No time. I'll tell you all I know once we're away. I 
Would you guys trust him? Would you? Fine. Let's go. No. They'll be watching the front entrance. We'll have to go downstairs and across. I would don't think I'd trust him. Stay quiet. Okay, let's be a little more a little more cautious about this. Mark where all the guys are first. Crouching over there. One guy walking around towards him. <coughs> Those guys are together, I can get a double assassination. But they're not close enough for that, so we'll just take out one at a time. And take out this guy. Keep moving. And I've got five guys downstairs, yeah. We have a phantom blade if it gets a little too hairy, so that's always our backup call. Hmm. Let's see, Wait. do we have berserker blade? No, we don't have any berserkers. Oh, is he coming this way? No. So we're gonna just drop off and kill this guy first. And then we'll go into sneak mode. That guy's gonna walk over there. Oh, I should have covered first, shouldn't I? God damn it. That's okay. We'll use the OP corner covering skills. Alrighty. These guys uh, are already drawn to me, so we'll use a Thunder Blade to take out that guy. And then this guy will hopefully go over and investigate him, and while he's done checking him out, we can run over behind him. Take him out nice and quick. I suppose that will do as well. <laughs> okay, so I suppose we're going to just pick this door as well. We may as well. There we go. This might lead us out behind our targets, which is always helpful. Yeah, it's a lot easier that. So we're going to double assassinate these guys. I was hoping to double assassinate these guys. But that's not going to work. And that guy's blocking me from actually hitting this one, so that's not good. But, never mind. They're dead. You'll pay for what, bruh? I'm going to pay for shit, boy. Okay. we got four guys in here. Using Eagle Vision kind of helps you, you know, get their patterns, because it highlights them for a little bit. So you can see where they're all going. So hopefully that guy comes and investigates. We can get him down behind the table if that guy there doesn't turn around anytime soon. But he is turning around, which is potentially problematic. That's okay. He's oblivious. He doesn't see shit. And I'm just going to see if this guy comes over or not. If he does, then I'll just take him out. If not, then... Oh, he does, yeah. Here he comes. And that's him dead. Now, this guy over here is focused on the fire. So we'll take out this guy. He's got a bit more of a wider field of view. Sort of planning your attacks. And this, taking guys out one by one, and... Right here, I believe we have a we have. Well, he calls them sentries, just snipers. So I don't know if I make a run for it or not. I think I'll throw a smoke bomb outside, and I just run straight through the smoke. That way, I can't be seen. So yeah, there we go. So yeah, make sure to use the Alexa smoke bombs and not to your advantage. You have them there, you may as well use them. Stop you. Yes, you. Take that guy out with their phantom blade and drop down for this guy. That's the thugs taken care of. Go back to this guy. Help me. Charmant. Change your plans. 
Oh, these guys are assholes. Once you pie them once, you can pretty much take care of them. If you get your pie timings right, you're okay. But you gotta keep an eye on do heavy attacks as well. So if they do heavy attacks, you gotta dodge if they... You know what I mean, guys. Let the silversmith go. Stay back. I'll be good. What have I done? Only what you <laughs> We've rubbed Come. off a bit on that guy. <laughs> yes, of course. Good assassin. Okay, Thomas. I'm Francois Thomas. Everyone else just calls him Thomas, so I'm gonna stick with it. I might as well just look. Thank you, my friend. You've done me a great service today. Perhaps you can return the favor. Yes, of course. May I? I made the first some years ago. A private contract. A man called Lafreniere. That seemed an unusual commission. I confess, curiosity got the better of me. Recently, I started to look into Lafreniere's background, and what I discovered, you wouldn't believe it. He's a Templar. Is that what you found? Yes. I believe so. I didn't know how to take it. In any case, I was careless, and Lafreniere found out about my schemes. In the house arrest ever since. I do as he bids. Weapons mostly. Where can I find him? Well, Lafreniere is a very difficult man to pin down. Not long ago, I overheard him talking about protecting the shipments at La Halle au Blay. Sounded ominous, whatever he meant. I may ask, why are you so interested in him? killed someone very dear to me. I want to know why. I see. You have my sympathies. They will come looking for you again. Make yourself scarce. Yes, I believe I might. He seems a pretty nice guy. Not a bad bloke. I'm gonna keep on saying this, but the animation, the design of this game is just amazing. I, I love it. But I think we're gonna go and grab another viewpoint here. And at the end of sequence 5, we'll get a few things upgraded and then we'll you know, run about grab a few things because it's all part of the full sync obviously missions are your main point main focus point on full sync and I just gotta double check if I actually did the full sync on that last mission I'm not sure if I did yeah I did okay that's cool completely forgot that I spent a good f few minutes trying to, trying to unlock all the doors so yeah grabbing some of the stuff is going to be a bit boring so, and after that I probably will uh, close down the stream for the night after I grab a few bits and bobs around the game, open a few chests, but for now we're going to complete sequence 5. And uh hope I've been helpful so far, sequence 1 through 4, getting myself 100 sync. This will help some of you guys out. Because, to be fair, this it's not an easy game. The other Assassin's Creed's, you know, you literally did the same thing over and over again. You know, block, kill, block, kill. Streak your kill on, make, you know, you kill one guy and then you point towards another. Which, I, I'll i be honest, I love that. I love the really high kill streak and just kept on going and going and going. Uh, it was really fun to do. But, um... Uh, I don't know, it just it seems a bit too easy, like a bit of a challenge. 
I'm actually going to fast travel here, uh, but I'm going to grab that waypoint as well. I think there's, you know, it's a bit of a bit of a walk, so we'll just fast travel for now. It's the first time actually using the fast travel um, to a viewpoint. Use it back to the cafe, but you know, it's in the cafe. I'm actually really happy with the with the turnout today. It's been pretty good. The last time I had a uh, lock of years was um, back when I was doing Dark Souls playthrough. Where I was doing fists only, or fist weapons only. It was uh, <laughs> it was pretty funny to say the least. Some of the bosses in that game, when you're trying to kill them using only your fists, can be a uh, a little bit irritating. <laughs> I think I'm also going to put up a list of games that I own. So that if you guys have any suggestions as to, you know, challenges or playthroughs or you know, just an end, it doesn't have to be complicated, it can be simple. You just want to let them see me walk through or find out how to kill a certain enemy or a certain boss in a game. Because generally when it comes to anything difficult, I do like to have a good stab at it. Uh, down from... Um, Sort of got that way from playing games like Dark Souls because obviously it is a it is rated one of the harder games to play. But honestly, if you learn patterns, learn timings, brush up on your skill a bit, get your rolls good, you can basically put bosses down. I can unfortunately only show Xbox One games that I own because I don't actually have you know capture card and stuff. I'm streaming this straight from Xbox. Uh, I can only show the Xbox One games that I can broadcast. Uh, also, uh, if you can let me know about the challenge run, that would be awesome because I, I guess anyone missed me talking about it. it uh, basically, you, you get to a point in the game where you can use bounties, but you don't pull up any further using missions. You do straight online play. And from that point on, so. Do missions until you're able to use bounties. And then after that, it's just online play. So, yeah, it gets a little... You know, it's really it's really fun to do. I mean, I'm not overly good, but... It's still really enjoyable. Obviously, you're playing online against level... You know what, level 32s, 34s, 35s. If they're easy, it's 35. I don't know if 35s are yet. But you're playing against some pretty tough enemies with very good weapons by yourself. Who's level right, 1 or 2. <laughs> Where are you hiding? Another assassination mission. Lafreniere. Is it? No, it's not. It's not. It's okay. False alarm. <laughs> Oh, I forgot about these two things, cockades. That's what those little. Um, I said it was a location marker before. So, um, but that it's it. But this part uh, is pretty difficult. Um, at this level, the end is a lot tougher. But of course, we're going to use our uh, cover kill cheat to get rid of these bigger enemies. Make life a little easier on us because they're quite they're. They got uh, them guys hit hard. <laughs> they hit real hard. Uh, pistol kills is what we need for this. So let's see if we can get a few. Obviously, I'm walking into this place without even having a look around. Pistol kills. I think I'll get pistol kills outside, uh, simply because pistols make noise. So if I start going through and popping people inside, you know, it's it's not going to be too good, really. 
the pup has head. And then if this guy comes at us, we can kill him, but he's not. He's just going to stand there, that's okay. And that's a couple of pistol kills got. We need one more. So I think if we get into a fight, we can get the last one. Uh, pretty easily. That is a distressingly large number of guns. Lafreniere must be planning something big. So in case you're wondering, all these crits are basically guns. Which is not good in case you, <laughs> in case you didn't catch on to that. Having that many guns. One guy with that many guns. So... Yeah, I didn't really want to alert those guys there. But, you know, it happened. It's okay. It's okay though. We got it covered. I'm gonna shoot him and just hide. Oh, we've alerted the bloody tire force, I think. <laughs> Can I join? I'm bo uh, sorry, dude, but I won't be actually doing any um, co-op till near the end of the game when I actually do the co-op. Um, what would you call it? The co-op missions. I won't be adding anyone to co-op. I'm afraid. Sorry, but uh after after the game's completed definitely definitely okay let's just wait for these guys to get out of my way a little bit okay take out these guys nice and easy uh i do want to get rid of that alarm See if we can get this nice and quickly. There we go. So there's something about here somewhere we have to investigate. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I'm sorry, Game Rover. I'm sorry, dude. And don't worry, it won't be too long Guns before before I do start uh, bringing people in. I can run through this game pretty quickly, so. As you can tell, I've already gotten through five, uh, four sequences and halfway through the fifth one, so. And now I know where to find you, Grandmaster. It hardly seems safe just to leave these lying around. It's quite the arsonist. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I'd be getting the hell out of there. No, yeah, see, that guy's smart. That easy, it? Dude, it's guns. Like, seriously, are you an idiot? Hmm, this door opened. That's strange. So now we need to get our way out of here. So. If you conveniently place things. Okay, run to the left side. Oh, wow. That would have hurt quite a bit. Maybe I should have thought this through. Yep. You definitely should have thought this through. Because if you ask me, this wasn't your smartest idea. I'm slowly going to burn alive if you don't start climbing. Just saying. Oh, 
Finally, Arno actually does something right. That that was really lucky <laughs> that he got blown towards that. Hide in plain sight, right? <laughs> oh, pass over under objects. No, <laughs> guys, I didn't even see it. I didn't even see it. Oh. No way. Ah, oh, that's ridiculous. Are you kidding me? God damn it. God damn it. <sighs> We're gonna have to replay the mission, guys. I'm sorry. I'm such an idiot. Total idiot. Oh, okay. And um, we're going to have to re uh, increase our resets command. Damn it. Oh, <laughs> so irritating. You have no idea. So, resets goes up to two. <clears throat> From one to two, and now I have to do this all, all right, again. Nothing, yeah. oh, Where are you don't worry, I'll try to do it as quick as I can. I don't want you guys to have to sit there and watch me repeat things over and over again. Because it can get really boring really quick, and I understand. I understand 110%, guys. So, we need to get pistol kills. So, pop one head, pop two heads. That's two of a pistol kill. So, one more. Again, do what we do. That is a disgustingly large number of guns. Lafreniere must be planning something big. Something's not right. Ah, screw it, we'll just fight them. Go a bit quicker. I'm such a fucking idiot. I can't believe I didn't even see it. Okay, so. Don't so we're going to and hide. Wait while they all disappear. I'm sorry guys, I'm an idiot. Can't believe it. I completely forgot it. Oh, it's so irritating. Not good. Oh well. We'll get it, we'll get it. We got this. We got this. Who did this? Come on! Shut up, hurry up and go away. No, you don't really care. <laughs> Before in some of the other games in the Creed series, when they find a guy dead, they would go straight away and instantly ring an alarm. In this one, they just sort of, they're like, meh, he's dead. Uh, oh well. So what? Guns from Bavaria. Hm. It's just me that you want. I'm literally going up here and interacting with this, and then that's the end of that. Okay, there we go. Now I go burn down the house again, you. Well, the house. Go burn down the place again, you absolute idiot. So, where does pass over and under objects begin? Is it here? Yeah, it's here. So that's over one. Under. Um.
Okay. I'm gonna need one more. And we're back on track, guys. Okay, we can pass over this, hopefully. Yes, that's it there. Oh. Okay, we're back on track. What we gotta do now is run through this, skip the area. Nice and quickly. And we're back to where we want to be. Yeah, up is good if you would jump, you idiot. Come on, I know I'll do this nice and quickly. If you fall and I have to go back down, though, I swear to God. Just crap up. I was smoother than last time. There we go. Mission complete, full sync. Yin, sorry, I messed up. My bad. I'm an idiot. Okay, we get it. Jeez, guys, tell it. Don't rip me apart. Sorry. And for the last mission of sequence five. And then we'll upgrade. Do a quick run around, grab a few things, and that'll be it. All good. Okay. Okay. Quick run to the shop. Uh, we need to buy. I'll kill these pricks first. <laughs> that would really hurt. <laughs> Some of the kills that you get are brutal. Absolutely brutal. I need to get a lot of money. I'm really low on money right now. So, I think I'm going to do some cafe missions as well. So the way I'm thinking is, I'm going to finish this next mission. Upgrade. Do some cafe missions. Uh, maybe just just one or two. Uh, probably just yeah, I'll do two. It, no, I'll do one. I'll do one mission. I don't want to step ahead too quickly. Uh, it makes it a little too easy. Um, grab a load of chests, which will get us a load of money. And just um, buy all my uh, health upgrades. Or buy well, health upgrades. Buy all my ammo and. Then I'll work on buying other upgrades. I think I'm gonna start with um, lock picking two, so I can get some of the red chests that are about. I won't be. I know a lot of them are. Uh, I know. I know a lot of them are level three, so we gotta, we gotta start small. <laughs> to that eventually. Oh, there's a. I can't be bothered. In there, and I'm basically here. So if I'm right, this is another assassination mission. I just hope I don't do anything. Actually, hold on. I'm not going to do this just yet. I'll get this first. I'm going to grab this chest first. Hopefully they'll give me enough to buy a, a couple of berserker darts. Just in case I need them. Because with no my luck, I'll get them. I'll need berserker darts. I mean, this is a lot to let me buy one, so. Symbols. Oh, yeah, it should let me buy two. Uh, Berserk darts. We want two. We gotta have two. If it asked me to get rid of two guys, or turn two guys berserk, and I don't have the darts for it, I would be pissed. Oh, I accidentally. Okay, he <laughs> accepted a mission. Uh, I'm afraid. Sorry, I didn't know. <laughs> sorry guys. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Uh, but yeah, we're just gonna run over and kill this guy. 
That's literally all those missions are, by the way. And, oh my god! 1,500 florins? It's not florins. It's not florins. Is it francs or leave it? I don't know. Hey, leave him alone, asshole. Oh, did that really... Oh my god. Awesome. <laughs> Looks like we can uh, refill our consumables. <laughs> wow, if I only knew they give so much. I think we're going to be doing a lot of those guys. Uh, <laughs> just to upgrade our cafe as well. Oh my days. I didn't think it'd give you that much. That's really handy. So this is a higher level mission, it says, and it means that we need to, well, we need to be a little more careful of this one. It's giving us a little, little hint there just before I jumped in, I just, you see a clip of it. Um, so, yeah, we're going to get into this. Let's see how it goes. All right, let's look at our opportunities. You'll be reinforced before the master arrives. We'll post snipers on the roofs. The instructions are all here. Okay, so I need to get rid of those instructions. What's this guy doing? We should go with them. The master's elite bodyguards? I think they can handle it. I suppose you're right. I'd better find myself a place to wait before the rest of them arrive. Okay. In case you guys didn't notice, if you've been watching from earlier, you actually see this guy. Um, I actually seen him. He was sitting there talking when we were going to meet Elise for the first time in that uh, party. Yeah, he, this guy turned around and actually pointed him out. Uh, but this is one of the Templars, uh, Lafreniere. So we're gonna go after him. So we've got a wait in the haystack, but of course. We're gonna we're gonna get ourselves a little bit of assistance from these guys right here. Assistance opportunity and a, an infiltration opportunity. And we've got a wheat in a hay bale. And trust me, it's all about p picking your picking your hay bales. So yeah, you don't want to jump into any hay bales at the minute because if you do, that could automatically put you into it if you choose to wait there. So, and that could literally be it, that's all you can do, so. But we're going to take out the alarm bells as well for our full sync. So be careful about jumping into the hay bales, because you can literally press wrong, one wrong button and that'll be you locked in the hay bale until the mission begins. And you lose your full sync and your assistance. And let's be honest, no one wants to do that today. See, these guys are a little harder. The Simchar's having a little bit of problems with them, but it's not too bad. So, what do we got to do with these guys right here? So, we're going to go down into the catacombs. This is our assistance opportunity. Where we are to defend the grave diggers. Come on, boys. Mess him up. Oh, wow. Nice, lads. Nice one. You came along at just the right time. I'll gather up the others. We'll hold position here. Escape if you need it. Good lads. Good lads. See that? What a nice group of fellas. Okay, so we've got one more. Rid of. Shut him up. Oh, get down from that, please. Oh no. Thank you. 
Yeah, most of the assassins have pretty cool names. Like, well, apart from Edward. Connor's original name's cool, so we'll give him that. You know, you have Altair, Ibn Lahad. Ibn, Ibn Lahad. So you do that bit, right? So yeah, Altair. Ezio. Ezio Arditore de Firenze. Some people's favourite. Your favorite? I always liked Ezio. Um, me and my friend have this to be. I was always a big fan of Ezio. He always loved uh, Altair because Altair is the master assassin. Ooh. Okay, we get it. Whatever. Ezio's cool. Old Ezio is a piece of shit, but proper Ezio is cool as shit. Oh. Let's see if this guy has any medkits. Medkits. Med medicine. What am I to say? Is that medicine? Do you have medicine? So yeah, I'll just pick this lock. Because I have level 2 now. Oh, no I don't. I only have level 1. Derp. I have to complete this mission before I get level 2. And I all we have to do is choose a haystack. So, um, I like the one over here. It's far enough away, it's only just on the edge, so it means that you're not too close to the fight. You have a bit of time for a bit of planning, you can sit back and relax. So, yeah. We'll, we'll chill here and wait. I love there we go. <laughs> I reckon those hay bales would be pretty comfortable. So just in case uh, I miss something you guys say, I uh, generally just tend to you know, do a quick refresh to make sure everything's running smoothly. So if I do miss anything you say, I'm sorry, but if I haven't replied to it, say it again. Now I'll be sure to reply to it. Peril, my brothers. She is beset on all quarters. Jacobins lay her on the rack, cruelly breaking her to their populist agenda. I'm ready to get those cover kills. Fall for it. Someone's bound to turn around and see him and come over to him. So, yeah, this guy notices it. Oh, they both notice it. Oh, okay. So I get at least one of them. Can you get two? No. I don't want the Grandmaster seeing me just yet, so I'm gonna. Get out of the way of the snipers. Gonna get our assistance down here. Well, 
Oh, I see. I see how it works. Okay. Okay. I see how it works now. This is obviously our skip it. Alrighty then. Gotta get over here. Fuck you. <laughs> then rise, my brother. And be welcome. You don't trust the man, do you? Mirabeau is a good man, an honest man. Mirabeau is a self aggrandizing drunk. Do not forget who is Grand Master here, Lafreniere. Take this to Grand Master de la Serre immediately. Deliver it to him in person. Yes, Master. Oh. Master, we have a problem. Christophe has been feeding information to our enemies. We must assume this location is compromised. We'll have to move up our timetable. Gather the men. We strike Hotel de Beauvais tonight. That guy gives the letter to be delivered to... There. So yeah, we gotta escape, so we're gonna go this way. And those guys will all come out and help us now. So yeah, the catacombs are a bit of a maze, so excuse me if I get lost, but it's bound to happen eventually, isn't it? So I'm just gonna run all the way to the far side of here. There's a stairwell out of it. I guess. So they cover my exit. And I'll just take these two guys out, and that's me, home free. And that's that. Should have got full sync for that there. Yep. 100%. All good. We'll probably get some form of a cutscene now. Initiate Bishop here. You're in good shape so far. I'd like to give you a little boost. We've made a major breakthrough on our side. Through deep data analysis, we've discovered that the sage we're looking for was a Templar Grandmaster, the same man Arnaud is hunting. It doesn't get much better than that. There, everything's been updated. Use them wisely. We'll be in touch. And that's how we get our assassin skills. Okay, so character customization. Let's do some leveling, shall we? Now we can actually use all these. One handed weapon master allows you to hold in X to create to do a charged attack, which is pretty good. It's pretty handy, to be fair. I might actually end up buying that. I don't know if I'll buy it just yet, though. Uh, I want to see a few other things. I don't want any of these. Stealth and double assassination, double assassination and lockpick. Uh, I need lockpicking too. Double assassination is good to get, but I really want lockpicking because it'll actually help me with um, a few things. Double assassination, no. I don't know, it's between getting my strong attack up and getting double assassination. Also health, I need health too, so... Right, how much do I need? Let me see. Double assassination is four, right? And where is it? Uh, get out of that, please. Strong melee is one hand, one hand of weapon masters four. So I need eight more if I buy health. Yeah, I'm gonna buy the health one just because I keep on dying. <laughs> so we're gonna buy health, and then we're gonna get up for for uh, what's it called? Credits? I don't know what they're called. We're gonna get four of them. Yeah, we need four. We can't actually buy our gear yet. We do need, if I'm correct, that's 5,000. And our pistol is also 5,000. 
Yeah, we're gonna need 10k. Shouldn't take too long to get. But we're gonna start off by going back to the cafe. Obviously our mission is right below the cafe, but we're not gonna start that yet. That is the start of sequence six right there. The Jacobin. Jacobin. Hmm. All right. I'm just sort of tossing ideas about in my head, guys, uh, as to what I'm going to do over the next few days. Uh, so I'm thinking that I don't want to do all of the Assassin's Creed straight away. Like, I don't want to run through it too quickly. It's not, well, let's be honest, it's not going to be very good if I run through it and, you know, show you guys everything really quickly and then as soon as it's over, it's just like, oh, well, that's it. It's over. It's done. Um, I much prefer books in libraries to on bonfires, don't you? One of our informants may have been compromised. She's posing as a scullery maid near Port... We need you to tell the innkeepers. Find out if they suspect her. And get her out she's in danger. Alrighty. But, uh, so now I'm going to do a few extra missions. Um, hopefully, like my four tokens. Uh, Run around, grab a few. Things. Fucking leave them alone. Um, yeah, so, a few side missions. And then we're going to start a couple of places, but don't worry, I won't be covering a places. I might even do a little bit extra on screen. Uh, just so you guys don't have to sit with me collect everything. I'll be saving the Nostradamus stuff. Do all of that uh, on on stream as well. If someone needs help with it, if you guys can keep up, of course. I've already done the first, so if you missed that, I'm sorry. But it's actually really simple. Just slowly make your way to the roof of the uh, cafe. First one is right, uh, right beside the book, the uh, or right above the book. The second one is um, on up the stairs. There's a picture of a woman in the corner. The second one's on it, and the third one's actually on the roof itself. Uh, yeah. Did I get rid of them? Oh, no, it's right there. Yeah, we're just gonna fast travel that. I'm not walking a lot. <laughs> Screw that shit. But yeah, the first Nostradamus Enigma is done. I'm gonna do all of them eventually because <laughs> they're quite annoying. I know where a few spots are. Uh, I might end up using the wiki, using some sort of guide just to get them all. Because they are very annoying. And these wee side challenges, which actually link to my phone, I think. Let me just end up check where I put my phone. Hmm. There it is. I'm pretty sure these link to my phone. Uh, yeah, they do. They link to the uh, companion app. Sorry, I started some stuff, I guess. 
Take my phone out of message from a friend asking me to go out tonight. Eh, I'm taking it easy tonight. I'm not going out for a little bit. <laughs> being good, being good. Oh, I fucking synchronized it. Oh, that's the really annoying thing about those viewpoints because you know you're meant to press, well, it tells you to press uh, the trigger and then up and B to jump off them. So you press it and it synchronizes because B and synchronize are linked to the exact same button. So, yeah. Don't listen to what the game tells you to do. <laughs> press A. Screw B, press A. So it untracked the mission that I was in the middle of. You can actually track, or uh, you can actually accept the little missions uh, while you're playing. So you can, you know, you can do a mission, and if you see one of the missions you track, like, oh, over here, because it's on my way to this other mission. And you can run multiple missions at once. Uh, up, uh, you having to, you know, Oh. Hello, I'll I'll I was upset when I did that. I suppose I was scared after I did that, but that's not the f Get this guy here. Yeah, I completely forgot what I was talking about now. <laughs> but anyway. Taking in war orphans. What do we do? Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Oh, well, you know. Hmm. We'll see about that, buddy. I don't think you will. Okay, what? Oh. This safe's gonna know me, and he's close, so I gotta get him. Pretty sure that's not the mission complete, though. Speak to Colette. Where's Colette? Yeah, so because I actually accepted another mission, it's not tracking this mission. Let me see, can I track it from here? I can! There we go. It's tracked now. That's how you do that, in case you guys need to know. But we also completed the crowd events. Completed 10 of them now, so we get the tailored Prowler hood. We actually need to uh, upgrade our armor a wee bit. What's the objective? I'm just assuming these guys are bad guys. Taking <laughs> them out as I go. Okay. Okay. Where do you think you're going? <coughs> Shove my blade through your face. Okay. What is that okay. Alright. Oh, I can speak to her. Madame Goose sent me. You are You need to get out of here. See it? I just tell her to leave. <laughs> I thought I had to actually get her out. Just now I have to get out of there. Okay. Okay, well, I'm not gonna complain. Makes it a little easier for me. And there we go. 
That's another Cafe Theatre mission done. Uh, let's see. One more thing, and just grab this um, social. Get it renovated. Just so that I have it. i grab as many social clubs as I can, and then we'll start collecting some shit. I think. Do any wee small missions we come across that I could be bothered doing? I'm not doing any co op missions, obviously, but. You know, wee small missions. Pretty easy stuff. Hmm. Yeah, guys, it's going to start to get into the slightly boring part of the part of the night. Right before I close it down, this is just sort of winding down a relaxing time right here. Where I'm just going to walk around, collect a few things. Open a few chests and uh, then we're gonna start to close her up, close her up, finish her up. Who's that guy then? I didn't see these guys. Oh, they are a high level. Level 5. Okay. Let's see if I can take them out. What do you think? Can I take them out? Four and a half dead. Oh no. So there's a tactic to kill these guys. I'm pretty sure it's uh, dodge, or, well, you can get hit three times, I suppose, if you really want to. But yeah, because I'm scared, because he's going to kill me. Oh, he dodged it. Oops. Oh, yep. Yep. Ah, <laughs> there is supposed to be a tactic to killing these guys. I just don't know it. Um, so yeah. And again, we're increasing the death counter. God damn it! I need to get good at this game. So we're up to nine deaths now. Isn't good. It's really not good. Nine deaths, one day. That's like a sin. But yeah, we'll go over to our, to our social club here. And then go back to the cafe, clear out the stuff around the cafe. At the start I thought it was going really well, you know? <laughs> but it's just started to get slowly more and more downhill. Speaking of dying, my controller just did. Bit annoying, but anyway. There's another one of the social clubs renovated. Café de Louvre. Louvre. Alright guys, so I think just to end off the night, we're going to clear out this entire middle section here. And then we'll probably do sequence... Uh, I think... Sequence... What is it? Six next? I think we've done five. Uh, these are all the Nostradamus Enigmas. I don't think I'll be doing them just yet. I'll be leaving them where they are. Because... <laughs> uh, I'm not going to sit and stress over them at the minute. Uh, this is the start of yeah, sequence 6. So we will do all this middle part 
and then sequence six and seven next time. Then we will do this. Take a while over here, collect and doing all the way side missions. And then we move up to past sequence nine. I think we'll clear this bottom part out just we have all the items. And um, when we're finished the entire everything and everything's good and raw. Then uh, we'll get all the enigmas and all those little little side parts that we need to do as well. So, um, so this is going to be the boring part, so, you know, don't worry, you guys won't hurt my feelings if you disappear. Go away and do something else. <laughs> I don't mind. I understand. But, yeah. I'm going to get cracking. got to look at some of these lock chests, though. I might not be able to get them all because I am only lockpick level 2. And I might need 3 for them. But, first things first, we're going to get the social club and then go back to the cafe. Fresh to make sure the streams are good and everybody's happy. Yeah, I think we're all good, guys. I think we're all good. In the other crates, this would be so much more difficult to actually get. Oh, we've got a more income. Chest, which we're going to be picking up shortly. The new just the whole descent is really awesome. You literally just hold two buttons and you go at such a great speed. Before it would have taken me a good few minutes to get there, probably. Okay, is there a way through? I have to go up. No, I'll just go the building. I have a climb over here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so far then. Okay. Put that boy down. Excuse me, boys. Bothered if I just them enough. Here we are. Just have to wait until he stops trying to look for me. You gotta become an anonymous person to interact. There we go. Five hundred. And that increases our income. No, I'm just gonna start from this top side and work my way down. I'm basically at the top of this point anyway, so I think we'll Yeah. Yeah. This here this is cockhead, right? Yeah. Where are these location markers? They're just uh points of interest. Which I think is actually pretty pretty intelligent that they have that because previously if you're looking for a location like in the old creeds where you had to uh, piece together something and you're looking for a location that doesn't show it. These are pretty handy to find out where everything is, to say the least. Okay. Fresh cockade. Work our way down. I might not be talking much during this uh, run and collect. I'll try to keep it as interesting as I can. I don't really have an objective, but just sort of running. So.
but overall today it has been a pretty productive day. Five sequences done. I don't know how many, hold on, I'll just double check. How many are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 sequences. Alrighty, I think by sequence 10 I want to have collected everything. And then 11 and 12 can just be purely focused on uh, this story, the, fin the finishing story of the game. And of course, we also have DLC. DLC is all to come as well. I wonder if it shows DLC over here. Probably doesn't. DLC's probably still. Well, it's probably in Power Stories, but it's the blanked out part that I can't see. But 20%. Uh, total completion for the first day is pretty solid work. <coughs> and of course I want to thank all you guys for sticking through uh, watching me play it. Hopefully I've actually helped a bit because I know that some of the missions are a little difficult. Um, so fighting, uh, <laughs> it's just going to take a while to get used to it. And as you can see, I'm still not used to it and I never will be used item on our item collecting run. Next up we have this chest right beside us. On the top of the roof. So yeah, I'll just in and out of the uh, map. Here, spotting where all the items are. I also have a quick look at the companion item tonight. Uh, the companion item, the companion app tonight to see if there's any little extras I can get that might, might help out through it. Yeah, we haven't had really any severe cock-ups so far. <laughs> Which is quite surprising. I'm sure we've forgotten a couple things or to something. But well, we've only had to reset twice. Oh, I did update that, didn't I? Yeah, I just want to double check that all my commands are working. Resets. And. Deaths. Deaths. Deaths is nine. Haha. <laughs> reset two missions, which is good. We'll sync. Symbols. Make sure we're all set for the next time we come on to play. Kick some ass. They need to kill too many people here, and I don't think there's any synchronization to be done. Okay. This is a another one of those rings. The diamond space. We're going back to Paris in the 19th century. Century Paris. Interesting. There still might be a few more things to talk about before the for the end of the video, but uh, for the end of the stream, That's same video. You have to free our agent and get to the exit portal. His original mission was to gather data from the Helix, so try to recover as much of it as possible. Okay. Here's some of the data we've been looking for. This is actually a credit run. Right away. That data is encrypted. You'll need to stand by it for a moment until I can access it. Okay, decrypting now. Done. Alright, I'll need more data to find our operative. So yeah, this but you just have to run around, it's just Gathering points. And you have all the points. There he is. You have 
Monsters Race. We actually have a full uh, full sync point for this, so it's collect more data to earn a bonus. Is part of a full sync, so because we're not in any rush at the minute, we still have another another full minute of uh, gathering that can be done. So I'm going to try to do this as quick as possible. I'm in a bit of a time scale, so I won't, uh, I won't talk a whole lot. Sorry, guys, but I'll be trying to do this nice and quickly the best of my ability. <laughs> There's kind of a pattern to follow as well. You can just sort of if you run along the side of the rooftops you can gather most of the stuff. Uh, jump off the wall please. Get off the wall please. Thank you. God. When is command when you tell him to do something and he won't do it. Oh, that could be a real <laughs> Up on the rooftops, so you can get. I think. Oh, no time. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I don't know if I'm able to get it. This area is becoming unstable. The simulation is collapsing. Get out. Oh, you don't be. I'm determined, guys. I'm determined. The operative is still trapped, but at least the data you found is worthwhile. Ah, oh, I didn't get the operative. Uh, I kind of want to retry it, but. Okay, no, I think we're good. That's good. I got uh, the full sync tick, I think. If not, I will repeat it, don't worry. I'll have another quick look at it. I was interested in making sure that I got all the data. <laughs> I didn't care less about anything else. Yeah, these are kind of like mini games. Give you a break from killing and let you run around a bit, test your parkour skills. Which Arno's is questionable to say the least. Just because some of the commands mess up, it's like any, it's like any parkour game. The commands are always going to mess up eventually, especially physics-based parkour games. But yeah, I'm actually not going to bother with these um, Helix missions, I just wanted to kind of do that one. But they're not really a collectible of sorts, and I want to get all the collectibles for now, so I'll do them all eventually, guys don't worry, but not right now. There's no rush, I have loads of time to get them all done. Because once you do one it just adds another and another and that will just take too long, so. Nah. I'll chill. I'll chill. Probably go up the bit that's climbable. That would be smart. This is inside the building over there, so it's bound to be a window because there's always a window. <laughs> I think this here. Uh, this one. There'll be a window up here somewhere. I can get in. I really want to have to. Can't go in the front so. I do need to get in. Let's try the other side. See if I'm uh, over here.
than expected. Press LT to enter the window. Press enter the window quicker and easier, apparently. Hmm. There's nothing down here. Is well, that was pointless. <laughs> nice one, Earthfall. Okay, and there we go. Alright. Seriously, it's like... Wow. Guess we can't climb on those. Let's just go up here. The balcony. I see it. That's right where we're going. Shall we? Okay, going now, guys. Next step. Oh, we have investigations, murder mysteries, and stuff to do as well. I think I'll leave all the main missions, like any side missions, till later on, and clear them all up at the end of the game. Uh, for now, I think I'm just gonna grab items, like chests, and uh, I'll do these with small missions here, the companion missions. I'll do them. I'm not going to bother with any of the power stores or anything, they cannot wait till the end. But for now I'm just going to collect chests and little items. And leave all the actual stories and stuff to the end of the game. But just uh, whenever it's over, still have something to do, you know. Still gives us something to play with. And of course we've got our co-op missions for people who are in the stream. See if we can get some of you guys in here. So again, I am on Xbox One, so if you guys have it, then there's a around near the end of near the end of the game. I will certainly be doing some social club missions. I actually have a social club already. Uh, so you just you can just join that and leave that after you've done your mission or whatever you want to do. Or you can stay in it, I don't mind. Or you can make a new one. Probably leave my one and make a new one. No, I can join it anytime. I'm sure the guys won't, won't hate me too much for it. Okay, lockpick. Boom. So as you can see, lockpick in level 1s, I've gotten really easy. Really, really, really easy. We're going to run across and do this little mission here real quick, because I, I enjoy them and they give me a lot of money. So I hope to have 10 grand by the end. This is simply because I need to buy two weapons before we start the next stream. I do need to have two weapons. Yeah, that's what I thought, bitch. <laughs> Just walk in with the sword out and everyone shits themselves. Okay, kill your target. No worries. 
Sometimes the combo goes crazy in this game. But still. It's fun. By far one of my... One of the games I enjoy the most are Assassin's Creed games. Hey, I really enjoy them. Let's see what sort of money we got. We got three grand. Need to get ten in total. Or at least five by the end of this. Ah, oh, this could be a tight squeeze. Miss one of our cockades over there. We'll go back for that, don't worry. I won't forget. But we're going to clear out over here first. So go for this chest. In front of me. And we'll work our way back. Nice, nice clean kills. I think they said two. Oh, it's a three. I can't do that one yet. Not even going to attempt it. It's pretty much impossible. I've tried it before. I ended up getting one of them, but that was it. <laughs> Sorry, lads. Fuck the police. <laughs> uh, we can't get that item just yet. It kind of sucks, but anyway. Level uh, threes gen generally have more in them, so. This one seems pretty heavily guarded. There's a couple of guys outside. Standing outside, so maybe there might be something. I don't know. Maybe. 400. Nice. Nice. Next one's right here. Down on ground level too, which makes it a little, a little easier to get to. And up above, I think I'll get. Maybe it's not up above. Maybe it's inside the building. Maybe I should have thought of that. <laughs> I uh, can get it through this window. Maybe there's, maybe there's, there it is. My turn. We actually have a grand waiting for us back in the cafe too. So we might just have enough. Might just have enough. I can't believe he took no damage from that fall. Like, zero damage from that. Oh, don't tell me I have to go all the way up there to get this. Oh no, it's on there. Am I blind? I'm not, I'm Am I blind? Um. Hmm. <laughs> uh. Ground level. Yo, I must actually be blind. I can't see this. So this is right here. Can anyone else see it? Anybody?
Is it, oh, oh, I get it. A derp. <laughs> Sorry, guys. We gotta go underground. What's the password? What's the password? What's the password? What's the password? Password. Really? I don't fucking know. Oh. Well, we can't get that one. I'm a total idiot. Ah, oh, guys must be screaming at me. Go on, go underground. Zoom out just a little bit. Uh, so yeah, we'll go to this one and go to this side of the church. Get the one in the middle. No mod point. Some no mod point, I wonder. And then get that locked one. Try to get this locked one and this one. Okay. So we'll go over here first. I'm busy got a straight path to it. I'm quite surprised to see people stick them with this. Uh, <laughs> uh, this must really have, a, have an interest. Let's see what I get. Let's see if I get lucky and strike gold. But this is part of Phil Sink, so leave him alone. Too fitty. Better too fitty. Alrighty, let's go to this one. Some of the chests, like in the early releases of the game, weren't openable because of the initiates thing was kind of half broke. It's still, well, for me, it still is. And it just just doesn't work for me. But, uh, yeah, some of the some of the thing chests wouldn't open. No matter how hard you tried, they just would not open. Like this one specifically, I ran past this a million times, and I was—I'd never opened this chest once until now. And now it just opens. It's just like, okay, you want me to open? I'm open. This one's underground. I don't know how to get underground in this church. Might want to start by getting inside the church first, but it's uh a wee way in is just around this corner though. Oh and I get a get a criminal. I think French speak really fast. I mean now I know I speak fast. So some people can't understand the Irish they speak really quickly. Where's my wee man? Yeah, it doesn't matter. I have the key. The key to the door. It's in here. Also, I should probably go up and check the nomad point while I'm up here. This is the wrong place I'm thinking about. Pretty sure it's there. Maybe not. I don't know. But yeah, I can remember on the um, companion app, 
actually sitting and having to search this place for um, you give me symbols and I remember sitting searching this place and oh my god it near killed me trying to find all the items or all the icons and up here on top of this is your nomad point Use it in the Assassin's Creed compatibility app. So that's part of the compatibility app. So totally 110% useless to me at this point in time. Which is great. Great. Totally great. So time to make our way inside. The Cathedral. Um, is this chest inside or outside? I need to know this. Is this just right here? Is it inside or outside? I think it's inside. Yeah, it's inside. And we're back in here. Let's see if I can keep on going down to the bottom, to like a base floor underneath ground. Oh, they made a real mess of this place. Alrighty. Uh, I need to get across to that. And I go across to here. There we go. Oh. That was pretty slick. Mm. Ah, it's a one unlock. That's okay, I can get this. Pretty easily. Coinage. Two hundred and fifty again. Now we get some way of getting this little beauty. Ah, oh, come on! I'm just passing through. Sorry for not being all holy, but this is me. Now you ring the alarm. Did you just make life hard on yourself? Fuck you too, right? I have a gun as well, mate, just so you know. So, yeah, how do I get underground in this place? There are stairs over here. It says there are. I can't see any stairs. Ah, there's stairs outside. Is there a way outside from here? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Up over the altar. Hey. Anyone who's watching is religious is probably screaming at me right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Up and over. Probably fast travel out of here. Can't be bothered running all the way back. Two gears are missing from this mechanism. Is that so?
was unable to find these two gears. I wonder. I'll have a quick run about see if I can find this. If anyone has any idea, let me know. But I'm not too sure. I need two gears for this mechanism right here. Oh, okay. I see. Hmm. Can I do anything with these gears? Yeah. So I guess I'm running about gear hunting. Is there any here? Surely there's something there. I'm not too sure, to be honest, guy. <laughs> I'll, I'll have a look. Uh, not right now though, I'll, I will have a look for them. See what I can find, but at the moment, I'm just gonna continue on. I have to remember to get this. I'll leave that, that'll be the last two I'll grab before it opens. Actually, no, it's great, I'll go do it in my... No, not that one, this one. I have no idea where those gears are. I will, I'll have a look for next time. So that I can remember to find the two gears for the mechanism. And some mass I was meant to remember as well, but... Um, yeah, I got a shit memory. <laughs> I got a real bad memory. I used to have a really good memory. Once upon a time. Oh. They really pissed people off back in the revolution. I hear screaming in China. Sorry, I'm not addressed in the past stories just yet. Oh shit, yeah, that was this. Uh, do. Then. So this. It's all about this. It's getting a little too late for me. Okay. Hey guys, how's it going? Hi. Nice dude. Two or three. It's a three. Can't do that one either. God, I probably should have waited until uh, a later point, but <laughs> I think I suppose I have less to worry about later on. Kill the criminals. Do I really want to? Do I really be bothered? I can shoot them, yeah. There we go. That'll do it. I don't know about our 10 grand target, guys. I don't know whether it's reachable. Oh no. All the way up there, really? I don't want to climb that. <sighs> Screw it. Let's go. It takes no damage from this wall. It's like, if it was me, that's, that's my leg broke. That's my leg book. I don't want my leg to break. Imagine you could actually, you know, free line like this. Some, some of you probably can. I don't know. Some of you might be able to. to next. 
so there was two red no no man I'm gonna leave the red chests uh, because I can't get most of them so that's that area this area cleared apart from these two kids over here I'm gonna leave the red chests because I can't be bothered sitting there running over to them and then not being able to use them so yeah that's kind of shit um yeah Lucky it's Yeah. Okay. Mm okay. Mm okay. Drugs are bad kids, okay. Hit out of 15. 7 to go. Uh, can I get down here without people asking? Oh, I can't. Yep, there we go. There's like, password. Like, fuck are you? I don't know your damn password. Another one collected. Alright. Now to clear this bit up right here. We only have a few things to grab here. And as always, we'll start from the furthest point. And, oh well, we'll get that on the way to our first point. But start at the furthest point, work our way back to the cafe. No more we're at the cafe, I think we'll be all good. I think everything will be good, man. It'd be sweet. It'd be sweet. I didn't even see that. That is so useful. And that's actually what you have to do to get that cockade. <laughs> I missed it by an inch. But hey, that's pretty handy. You literally just stand here and dive off. That's pretty cool. I like that. And now we'll go get this. Actually, that red chest is right beside us, so I'm going to give it a go and probably get the cockade beside it as well. Uh, see if I can get this. I'm gonna I'll get up with that and say, You need luck, pick it skill three. I'm like, Oh, well, fuck you, too. Excuse me, gentlemen. I'm not here to hurt you, don't worry. I mean, I could if I really want to, but I don't really want to. Is it on there? It must be. Ah, it's in here. Oh, wait. What? Uh, derp derp, uh, make derp derp, uh, herp derp. Herp derp derp. Okay. Easy. Peasy. And. Must be down at the bottom here. There she is. Excuse me, people. Don't mind the crazy guy jumping about the place.
Okay. Blue chest right here. Let's get it. Let's get her done. Wow, 750. Nice. We're getting all closer to that goal. I mean, if we get five, I'll be happy with five. Leave that. Leave these boys alone, will you? Come on. Whatever they do, huh? Oh, I marked the. <laughs> Oops. I had to mark the chest. It's up in a house somewhere. Is it this house? It is this house. Drag this. Thank you. Thank you very much. And whoopty flipty whoopty. Yeah, we'll go to the shop real quick. We fell on the consumables. I think I only used a couple of gunshots though. But there we're sitting at six six K everybody. Not too shabba a ding dong. I don't think we'll have ten. Hey classic, how's it going man? You all good? Good 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 to see ya. Artifact. Alrighty. Got a couple more things to grab here on this building. Lock chest up here. Why is it? Up top. That's alright. Makes life a little easier. If it's up on the roof, then you don't have to go hunting for it. A couple of guys causing mischief over there. Nah, yeah, I'll get. I'll get them eventually. <laughs> Lockpick. Oh, just about got that one. That was right on the edge. Mm -hmm. 150. That was a bit dull, isn't it? <laughs> Where's your cash, man? Give me that cash. Arno needs uh Arno needs to pay the bills. Hello again to everybody in chat, just making sure you guys are all good. You're all good. <coughs> How is we all doing? This fine evening? I'll have a good summer, I hope. Being in nice places or done fun things, and if, of course, you are of legal age to drink, done plenty of that. <laughs> I can assure you, I have. <clears throat> Wouldn't be Irish if I didn't drink, huh? <laughs> or so they say, so I'm told. I'm good, thanks. Real good. How are you doing? Thanks for asking them. Taking it easy, you know. Bit of Creed. It's a pretty awesome game, to be fair. For anyone who doesn't have it, definitely a good buy. It'll keep you going for a while. But yeah, I'm awesome. I've had a really good day. <laughs> How's your day been?
Lockpick level 3 even to get into this room. Can't get this one yet. Means that chest must be good. I will not forget you. I think this might be one of the last uh, last things we grab. Oh, awesome. You just got unity yesterday. Oh, you should have caught us earlier, man. We've been playing all day. Been showing how to get full sync the whole way through it, so always free to go back and watch some of that. And we'll be on the past highlights, of course, for the next wee while, and then we'll be picking up the next one. I don't know if I can get it uploaded to YouTube. I might be able to, and if I can, I will definitely let you guys know in the next stream. Uh, at the minute, I'm not too sure. Uh, one more little chest back here. Oh no, that's a chest we can't get yet. Okay. Training room. We'll grab this little chest here. Grab our money bags. But yeah, we've been doing full sync the whole way through today. Now we're just collecting a few things. Making, making our job easier later on. Grand and a half, basically. One and a half grand. It's pretty it's pretty good, not gonna lie, it's pretty good. Eight two five nine. Very, very close to our target of ten grand by the end of the night. Uh I'm trying to think. I don't wanna crack into anything just yet. Uh, um, uh most of these I can't get. But I do need one and a half grand. Well, just over one and a half grand. So. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? You know what? I will buy it as soon as I have the money for it. Instead of going now and farming. I don't want to farm through this game. I want to do it as I get it. Don't have to run out and do missions just to grab something. I just want to run, do it as I get it without any rush. So we do need a better weapon. And I'm thinking the Saber. Because... It's the same as the... Uh, pretty similar to the Falchion, really. It's level 4 weapon. I was level 3 at the minute. As we go into level fives, but uh, I'm trying to say I don't think there's much difference. But we're gonna go for the officer saber uh, right now. Uh, hmm. We can upgrade it. I have loads of coins. Yeah, we're gonna upgrade it. Hell yeah! Extra twenty-five percent damage. Can't complain about that, can we? So we've got level four now. Right? That's the big boys. Level fives. I do want the katana. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. But I do already have a level five weapon. I do have it. We will obviously be going to the eagle of sugar. It's just gonna happen. But that's our next upgrade, and that'll be done by. Say sequence sequence nine ish. Yeah, we'll do it. Sequence nine. End of sequence nine. Start of sequence ten. I think we'll go for that. And then we'll finish off the game with the Eagle of Sugar. That'll be the last thing we get. Uh, pistol is up next. Arno's pistol will be our next buy. Can't get it right now. I don't quite have enough dough for it. 
Might I, uh, I think I'll upgrade this for an eye uh, until we get on this pistol. Then we'll upgrade it. As for our armor, just getting to that knife. <laughs> uh, colors, the uh, blue. Utopia blue. Head, we've got to get some new stuff here, guys, because I am currently running low. But we did pick this bad boy up. And we do get extra money for it. So. I think I'm gonna stick around for now. Because it is free, it doesn't cost me anything. We did pick it up. And it is a level, it's level three. We'll be going to level four and stuff later on, but we do have, I like wearing the Prowlers, or the uh, the Prowler set. I think it's called the Prowler set, isn't it? Let me see. I gotta check here. I think, yeah, I like wearing the Prowler set. The Prowler set for me is pretty good. It all depends on your modifiers. If you look at the modifiers and the stats uh, you get from the stuff you own, like right here, I actually own a legendary medieval hood, and you get the eagle vision range, eagle vision duration, and the cooldown. Also, you get extra creed points, health, and uh, assassin's cache duration. So, if you're using that assassin's cache for your special ability, um, personally. My favorite hood. Ooh, that's a good question actually. Probably the Prowlers. I mean, looks and what it gives you. All in all, pretty, pretty good. Right now though, we're going with the tailored Prowler hood. And yes, we're going to upgrade it. That'll keep us going for a little while. Next, we've got our chest. We gotta get some new stuff. Arno's tailored coat is what we unlocked, and we're gonna put it on. Uh, as for any armor that we have here, no, we don't actually have an item in it. But yeah, what armor you use is all dependent on what modifiers it gives you and what you'd like to stick with. Personally, if it gives me extra stealth, um, and or like because like with your cuffs you get the additional berserker darts and uh, that's pretty helpful berserker darts and the prowler darts and um, stuff like this is really good for your health but not so much stealth and whereas you look over here it's all about doing stealth like that's a pretty good one if you're going for stealth <laughs> I'm not gonna lie uh, legendary prowler is kind of mine, you know, you get a bit of health, you get a bit of your stealth up, you sort of have the balance. It's all about your balance. Well, for me, it's all about the balance. But yeah, so we're going with uh, this, and yeah, we'll upgrade it. This is Arno's actual tailored coat. We have his tailored hood and his tailored coat. Now, so, forearm. What you need to watch out for when you're doing these is the. For me, it's the amount of additional. Phantom Blades and Berserker Blades you get is what I look out for. So we want a level 3 one. Don't want to go too high level for level 2s. We want to stick with level 3. Uh, so we get some additional damage and high profile notes from armors. But, uh, you know what? We're going to go Arno's, uh, Ar Arno's tailored stuff is what we're going to go for. All of his tailored, tailored gear. For this section, waste this is all about your smoke bombs and stun bombs and ammunition. So, Arno's tailored belt gives him just pure more smoke bombs, more cherry bombs, more ammo, and it's just what you want, really. I haven't actually done anything with my YouTube channel yet, uh, but hold on, I'll see if I actually. I don't know if I have it under Merzo or or what. Uh, let me see now. Who are doing my channel? I have done zero with this uh, ch channel, to be honest. Um, let me see. Let me do some settings. Oh, 
Hold on. Sorry, guys. It's going to be a little boring for a second. I have to do some things here. Uh... Oh, I have to go through all this fucking setup shit. Uh, I won't be able to do anything with my. Um, oh, damn it. I won't be able to do anything with my YouTube channel tonight. It will be. Uh, I'm afraid it's going to have to be uh, the next stream, which will be in the next uh, couple of days. Don't worry about that. I won't be <laughs> leaving you hanging for too long. It'll be the next couple of days. And then I'll be streaming again. And I'll have my, hopefully have my YouTube channel sorted out and looking a little better. Yeah. But yeah, for now we're just gonna make ourselves look, look cool with all our nose tailored stuff. We go. Arno is tailored to perfection. And yeah, upgraded. Upgraded as well. Okay. And do, 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 do. So yeah, apparently I had to verify my account. Whatever. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna bother with any of that at the minute. I'll start up my YouTube channel off stream and have it ready for the next time that I stream. But, uh, your question is, do you want me to dress up like Edward? I think... I know, I know what I'll do. I'll just leave it as who I... I'll leave it as himself. I love how he could be King Louis. I think that's awesome. Also be Napoleon. And a reader. That's awesome. But no, I won't dress up with that. I won't put on any outfits. I'll just wear Arno stuff and make it look awesome. So that's gears. I'm a gear done. I'm a gear done. Gear. Oh, because I've been away for so long, there's probably more stuff in it. Yeah. Can I make any further upgrades? A good day to you, sir. Don't worry guys, I'll make a links page and stuff. Um, to all my links, any way that I can be contacted, etc, etc. Uh, but yeah, for my general uh, email, it's actually xxmojo xx at hotmail uh, dot com. So, don't worry about coming in, so don't worry about sending me an email saying hi. I don't really care if you spam it. Not, I don't really use my emails all that much. I go and check them if there's anything that I need to do or say or sort out, then I'll do them. But other than that, that's about it. So, we're currently at level 4 advanced soldier. Um, after all that upgrading and stuff. Um, yeah, guys. Uh, I I think that's us. I'll just double check. I'll show you guys the progress so far. I'm uh, playing on an Xbox One as well. Uh, so, I think it's one, two, three, four, and five. All 100% synchronization. Ready to start sequence six. And we've got a load of different wee small things about there when we were running about. Um, Cafe is looking pretty good at 40%. And overall, Overall, pretty, pretty slick. I just gotta check one thing on this real quick. It won't be that. Uh, let's see now. Get this open. 
and Okay, okay. Not much to do. This guy has a mission for me, apparently. Wherever he went to. He's meant to be like here, but it must be downstairs. Uh, do, 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 do. Gotta just check something real quick. Yeah, too many things to to go through and check. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry guys, uh, <laughs> I'm bored trying to, um, uh, let me see, don't know if there's anything else that I really need to do right now. Okay guys, um, I'm just uh, checking a few things here, but overall I think I'm good to pretty much close it out here, uh, that, oh shit, what am I even doing, <laughs> I'm all over the place, sorry. Ah, never mind, whatever. Uh, yeah, that's going to be the end of it, guys. Uh, thank you all so much for tuning in and watching me today. Hopefully, I helped you out through sequence, th through sequence 135. And thank you guys for all the follows, all the comments, all the, you know, the crack. It was awesome, guys. Thank you so much. And uh, I'll probably never stop saying thank you, just so you guys know you're going to be really really irritated <laughs> with the amount of times I say thank you. Uh, just to show you one last time guys, exclamation mark deaths, exclamation mark resets. And that's what we're setting out at the minute for the amount of times we had, we died and the amount of times we had to reset. Uh, but yeah, that's me for tonight guys. Uh, I'll be back shortly in the next couple of days doing a bit more streaming. And be sure to follow me if you want to know when that is, um, when I come online. And actually, we'll do one more thing just to double check, see if we have any extra little followers joining that didn't tell me that they were going to join. Mm -hmm. I like checking because I like, you know, I like saying hi to anyone who does. And we do indeed. We have classics. Classics, thank you so much for the follow, man. Appreciate it. And guys, that's me done. And I will see you all next time.